Good morning, it's Steve Reed in Chicago with the Morning Grain Comments. We have a mixed trade in the grains with beans up three cents, meal gaining on soybean oil, corn up two, while wheat's anywhere from five to seven cents lower. Looks like the stock is going to open lower, the dollar, the stocks are open higher, the dollar is lower, and crude is lower. Gold, silver, copper are all higher. Um, kind of a mixed trade, again, going into tomorrow's USDA report. Uh, the market's expecting maybe some friendly numbers in beans, but maybe negative numbers for corn and wheat. Some people think that maybe uh, prices are already reflecting that. Um, we did note that um, the Russians rejected any offer uh, by either the UN or Turkey in reopening the Ukraine uh, export corridor. So Ukraine's gonna to have to ship their grain out uh, via Europe uh, and many countries, especially Poland, uh, do, do not want Ukraine grain to lower their domestic prices. As far as weather is concerned, Hurricane Lee uh, is turning uh, north and uh, but now has a uh, direction of maybe a little bit further west than it was yesterday, which means it might come in as a category one or two in the state of Maine. Uh, we'll be watching that pretty closely. U.S. Midwest um, has got some rains today here in Chicago. Uh, we have 6 to 10 day and 8 to 14 day is mostly dry with temperatures uh, near normal to some places uh, above normal. That should help the uh, corn harvest. Early yields are a little bit disappointing in the corn. Um, again, uh, we'll be watching pretty closely uh, about the impact that uh, many of the Midwest states did not have rain after August 15th. Uh, some people that might think that that might bring in a lower ear weight and size and could affect the final soybean yield. And any yield below 50 in the U.S. tightens the U.S. 23-24 um, outlook. The uh, South American weather, again, dry across central and northern uh, Brazil. Rains in southern Brazil and maybe eastern Argentina uh, the Black Sea uh, continues to be warm and dry, um, and Australia is also uh, mostly dry, uh, very El Nino-ish. Uh, so uh, mixed trade, beans and meal higher, um, the uh, corn market higher, wheat and soybean oil lower, stocks are higher, uh, the crude market is lower, while the dollar is also lower. We've got the USDA report tomorrow. Uh, this is September 11th, uh, a very sad day for U.S. history, and there will continue to be remembrance of those who died that day. Um, New York, Pennsylvania, and uh, then the destruction uh, of the uh, Pentagon.